Hmm. Hey YouTube, this is a video of my City Commander chest and head armor upgrade. Um, it has a distinct resemblance to Power Master Optimus Prime. I got the inspiration from Transformers and his Power Master Optimus Prime, uh, made after the original City Commander. And um, uh, it's entirely made out of styrene. The head is sculpted after G1 Power Master Optimus Prime and Andy Wildman's Power Master Prime from the comics. Just this in the trailer, and the head will be able to transform. Very similar to the original fans project chest piece. This head, this head I primarily sculpted after Andy Wildman's concept of Optimus Prime, Power Master Optimus Prime, and a lot after G1 Power Master Optimus Prime. If you look closely, you can see that I used a lot of super glue and baking soda. Uh, this isn't the face that I'm going to use. I'm actually planning on putting some lighting and light piping in there. Next step is to put the pipes on the sides of his helmet and fill in a lot of the gaps. All right, so this is the this is how it looks in transform mode. Um I could put the head in, um, and I could much easier use my hand with the big band-aid on it, and um, yeah, so that would fit on the inside. I don't have the chest piece yet, I, don't, I haven't started that yet. Um, as you can see, this fits in over here, this little gap over here, which I, I'm going to widen, uh, just to mimic a little bit what the fans project did. Also, I think it might be cool if I could fit. Power Master Prime's head in there. Although that's not what I'm going for. And for the flaps that'll fit down in here. Um, again, I think it'd be cool if I could have him somehow in there. But that's just a gimmick and maybe I want to not, not even pull that off. Oh, that was chance for him did anyways. So that's something like how I want to get the chest. Uh, just a rough idea. But we'll see how it turns out. And um, yeah, that's it. I will get back to you once I've gotten some thing to update about. This might be next. Vroom. Hello. Bye, YouTube.